Hey, what's going on guys? Chris here from Crypto Side Chats. So Solo Road. That's what I'm gonna be talking about today in this video. If you haven't heard of it, and you might not have. I mean it's blowing up, don't get me wrong. It's really it's really doing well. But I don't see that many people talking about it. And it's fairly new still. But I really like it. It's a cool project. I'm gonna tell you about it here today. Um, what I'm doing with it. And if you want to join us, I have a link down below you can get in. Um, not financial advice. Do what you want. I'm not suggesting you get into this. I'm just showing you that you can get into it if you want. It's something I'm doing. I decided to put out these videos, kind of just showing what I'm in my journey in crypto and DeFi. And I think it's kind of fun. And I like to explain these projects such as solo road and really anything in crypto in general and especially in DeFi, is highly highly risky but can also be very rewarding so it's a mix of investing and gambling really it's a combination of both and i kind of like that it's kind of cool there's a there's an element to it of you know newness the Wild West kind of feeling where anything can happen, anything can go. The lack of regulation is good and bad. I mean, the bad part is there's no regulation. These things can just quit by, they don't, they'll take your money and they're gone, which has happened plenty of times and it's happened to me. That's the risk, right? The good part of, of being the Wild West out there, DeFi, no regulation is well there's no regulation so you can get crazy gains and make a lot you know huge rewards with these protocols but it is a risky venture and it's only risk what you can afford guys to lose because you never know but that makes it fun for me i like doing these kind of things the space is getting better i think a lot of the bad apples are kind of being weeded out and better protocols and I think Solar Road one of them is making making their name for themselves so I don't know if the thing is going to last two more days or two years no one knows right we hope it lasts a long time that's why we get into these projects we just got to keep an eye on it be smart only put in money you're willing I mean really willing to lose because it could happen. We could also go crazy and gain a lot of money. So that's why I decided to put these videos out here and the stuff I'm doing. And if you like that kind of stuff, come join me. Like I said, there'll be a link down below if you want to get in the Solar Road. But you can see their, and I'll tell you more about this here in a minute. But their SOD coin, which is their growth token, is at 1349. Four weeks ago, roughly, when I got into it, I think it was about four weeks ago, roughly. I can't remember exactly. It was at $40. That's how much it's gone up in that price or in that time. So it's crazy how, that, how this is really performing. And you can go look at the website and see how the tokenomics work and how this works and how much SOD coins out there, how it gets burned, why it increases in value, and what they're doing with the supercomputing and all that kind of stuff. But me, I look for protocols that allow me to invest my crypto, my money, in the, in the chance of making passive income, daily yield. That's, part of, that's what I like doing. That's fun. I enjoy it. And it can be very rewarding. Or it can, you can get totally wrecked on some of these things, too. A lot of times, though, you, get, you hear, like, oh, it's a Ponzi scheme or those terms thrown around. Yes, that has happened, but a lot of times things just go bad. Like, the protocol just didn't work out. And the money you invested in, well, it's gone. They didn't really steal your money. Now that has happened. But a lot of times they just, they mismanaged the project and your money is just, it's lost. So keep a close eye on these kind of things if you decide to get into them. 
But there's a similar project out there that's been going for roughly a year, I believe, and the name escapes me. I forgot what it was, FinTech or something like that. Don't quote me, but it's something like that. But very similar to Solo Road and how they structure their, their protocol and what they're trying to do. And their growth token, which is like their SOD, went up to $58,000. Which is crazy. And it's still going. It's been going for a year, roughly. So this thing has potential. Will it do that? I don't know. Who knows? It might, it might not. But I know it went from 40 bucks to $1,350 in one month, basically. So it has traction. It's gaining. It's doing well. And it's not too late. It's like I said, it's only been around the U.S. and the States for roughly a month. So it's still new. If you want, so you want to jump in, go for it. Not financial advice. But let me show you how it works um, if you want, if you want to uh, join us in Solo Road. It's pretty simple. So you, if you click that link down below in the description, you'll be taken to this dab right here. And what you want to do is make sure you have what I recommend is USDT. I think you can put other coins or other crypto into, into it. I'll show you in a minute. But when I first got started, it was only USDT. So just, I recommend just doing that. Um, because one reason is because the A coin they use, which is their native coin that you're going to earn by leasing out your crypto, is pretty much pegged one to one to USDT. So that's my recommendation. So it's on the Binance Smart Chain. So use MetaMask or whatever wallet you're using and get USDT on the Binance Smart Chain into your wallet. Then what you want to do, let me click right here. So you can be on this dApp when you click on that link below. Click on the little bar icons here. You want to go to wallet. Now this is the wallet, your wallet in Solar Road. You can see like, by the way, I've only done, I've only tested this. I put 250 bucks in just to see how it's doing. And I'm going to get ready to put more in because I'm liking it. But anyways, so now you have money on your MetaMask or whatever wallet you're using. You want to deposit, right? Once again, you can deposit any of these, but I recommend USDT. And then whatever amount you want to deposit. Hundred bucks, thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars, whatever you're willing and comfortable to put into a protocol such as this, not knowing if it's going to be here tomorrow. That's one way to look at it. Hey, look, I'm putting, I'm gambling on this. I'm investing, but I'm also gambling, hoping for that reward. But the risk being, they shut the website down tomorrow and it's gone. Just keep that in mind. So you put that in, confirm. And then you'll have in your wallet USDT or whatever one decided you put, you put in. We're just going to stick with USDT and that's what I recommend doing. So now say you put, you got $1,000 in here in the Solar Road wallet after you deposit it in from your own MetaMask or whatever wallet you're using. Now what you do is you go to leasing. But here's where you can lease out your crypto. So if you put a thousand, by the way, you can put whatever you put ten thousand into the wallet in Solar Road and then lease out a thousand. Doesn't matter, but to me that makes any sense. If I'm gonna lease out the money, I'm gonna put in, you know, I'm gonna put in five thousand into the into the wallet, Solar Road, and I'm gonna take that five thousand and lease it. Right? So example is one thousand. USDT, once again, you can do whatever. And this is where you pick your, your time. Okay, this is what you earn every day. So you can do 15 days, 30 days, or 60 days leasing uh, time frame. I did a 60, because I believe it's gonna be, be around but whatever you're comfortable with. And you get paid a certain yield, right? So the longer you, you go, so if you do this 60-day 
uh, lease cycle, you get 1.2% per day passive income paid out to you in ACOIN, which is pegged to USDT. One to one. If you don't want to go that long. By the way, these aren't very long leasing. I don't know. If you guys are all, if you're new to all this kind of stuff, a lot of these protocols out there, when you invest into them, they want you to put your capital in there six, eight months. You know, that's common. So these aren't very long at all. That's another reason I kind of like it. If you want to do 30 days, you're more comfortable, you're going to get 1% yield per day. Or you could do even 15 days and get 0.8% yield per day paid out in their A coin. Now you can also auto renewal. So auto renewal allows you to continue enjoying profits from leasing under the same cycle. You can turn it off at any time. Please use auto renewal at your own will and enjoy. <laughs> like how they said that. So if you're not, if you're just like, say, hey, look, I, I like this. I'm just not going to worry about it. I'm putting my money. I'm auto renew and let it do its thing. Do that. But if you want to keep a closer eye on it, which I kind of recommend, maybe not do the auto renew, but keep an eye on it because you don't want to get to your end of the lease and it gets expired and you don't renew if you're liking what's going on. So that's it. That's, how, that's one way you earn with Solar Road. You lease out your USDT for 15, 30, or 60 days, and you get paid accordingly that daily yield of either 0.8% for 15 days, 1% for 30 days, 1.2% for 60 days. Every day, and they usually pay out around 230 PST, I believe. And then you can do what you want with that. So as you earn the A-Coin, you can then go swap it out for USDT, because it's one-to-one, -one, and withdraw it to your MetaMask wallet. <coughs> Excuse me. That's the one way you can earn it. The second way, which is pretty cool, I think, is once you're earning the A-Coin, you can go to the SOD mining. And they got four pools to get into when i first got into it they didn't have these three you only had the supercomputing pool and when you take the a coin and you stake it for sod and you're going to earn a daily output of 1.5 percent in this one and there's no cycle involved you know just take out whatever you want that's all you could do in the beginning now they've added these three brand new this like yesterday they did this i believe or maybe two days ago so now you can do something similar you can with the A-Coin. So you can do 15 days and get 1.7% output in SOD. You can do 30 days, get 1.9%. Or 60 days and get 2.2. And then with these other three, the Mirai, Star Pool, and Galaxy Pool, you're also getting a supercomputing module NFT, which I don't know anything about. I don't know what that's about. I got to look into that. But it's something else they're offering. So they're growing, they're, they're growing their protocol, which is cool. It's nice to see. And this, all, this is all brand new. This is, like I said, a day old, maybe. So they're moving. They're doing, doing stuff here. And it's really, it's really taken off. So I like it. So that's the second way you can earn. And then you can take your SOD you earn, claim it, swap it out, USDT, USDT and get over to your MetaMask. Um, and the third way, I'm looking at this NFT. I got to do some research on it. I don't know what this is about, but it sounds interesting. Um, the third way is aff with affiliate marketing. Kind of what I'm doing here, right? Sharing the protocol. Telling people about Solar Road. And if you bring people into the protocol, you're going to get, get rewarded for it. You're going to get a percentage of yield based on what these people decide to pledge that you bring in. So there's really three ways you can earn with Solar Row, which is pretty cool. You got the A coin. You're getting a yield of either 0.8%, 1%, or 1.2% per day. 
on the money you leased out. Then you got the staking, which is very powerful, where you can take your A coin, stake it for SOD, and that's a growth token. And like I said, there's that project similar to this that's been going for a year now, and their growth token went at $58,000. Will this do the same thing? I have no idea. But it has gone from $40 to thirteen fifty in a very short period of time. So that's the second way. And then the third way is just affiliate marketing. Promote it if you like it. Um, tell people what it's about. Be honest with, hey, look, this, like, I've, like I'm doing here with you guys. There's no guarantee in any of these kind of pro- projects, um, platforms, investing protocols that they're going to work out, right? Like I mentioned earlier, this is investing slash gambling. There's no way to get around that. That's what they are. They can disappear. (laughs) And if people understand that and they're willing to put some money into it with the hopes of a reward, right? With the hopes of earning passive income. But knowing that it might not and you might lose your money. That's part of the fun to me, right? Because the reward is so high, the risk is out there. Just don't be stupid with your money. Just tell people, look, yes, you can make some money. Watch this stuff carefully. See what's going on. Pay attention. Do your research. And don't... If something happens and this goes away, I don't want someone to be devastated, right? They got, you know, they have $20,000 in their savings and they put it all into this. And then a week from now, it shuts down. They can't get their 20000 out. I mean, that would be terrible. So I just tell people, and if you decide you want to do some affiliate and promote projects like this, just tell them that. Only put in what you're willing to have it disappear tomorrow and it won't affect you. That's it, guys. That's it right there. Take a look at it. I have a link down below if you want to join us. It's pretty cool. I'm going to start putting out more videos on stuff I'm into that I'm liking. And uh, you guys can join us, join me in this crazy wild west of DeFi. It's fun, it's risky, it's gambling, sure. But the rewards are pretty high. And the risk is pretty high. But to me, that's fun. I like doing it. If you like the kind of stuff, come join us. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.